What's going on guys? It'll be Friday morning. It's your buddy Freak Show here and we are on the search for Zer again. Uh, looks like this week he is over by the speaker um, next to the all familiar big metal door that we don't know where it leads to. Um, let's go check out and see what he's got for us and uh, go from there. Uh, he has an insurmountable skull for it for the Titan with discipline and strength build. Um, looks like we've got hands on gain super uh, gain bonus super energy from melee kills on minions of darkness, heavy lifting which is a uh, bonus super energy from heavy weapon kills, and invigoration and gain bonus melee energy on orb pickups. We also have the ATS eight arachnid. With an intellect and discipline build. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ashes to assets. Gain bonus super energy on grenade kills. Second thought. Gain bonus super energy from special weapon kills. And once again, invigoration. Gain bonus melee energy on ore pickups. The Apotheosis Veil. With an intellect and discipline build. Um, inverse Shadow. Increased super energy gain from killing means of darkness. We've got second thoughts. Uh, gain bonus super energy from special weapon kills on minions of darkness. Uh, innervation, uh, bonus grenade energy on orb pickup. Uh, we've also got the bad juju, which uh, is a full auto pulse rifle. Um, it has hip fire, uh, bonus accuracy while firing from the hip. Armor piercing rounds, send it, increases uh, range and accuracy. Uh, perfect balance, you know, we all love its stability. And uh, the exotic cur... Uh, Pardon me, is like perk string of curses. After each kill, this weapon will reload instantly and increase damage for a short time. Kills will help charge your super. And yes, it does. This is something really good, guys. If you're if you're doing a nightfall or a challenge of elders, I use this gun a lot in my solo runs on challenge of elders. It's excellent, excellent for supers. Uh, year one legacy Ingrams he's carrying that are the gauntlets. Um. Emerald Coil, Stealth Drive, Heavy, heavy Ammo Simp, Three of Coins, Glass Needles, and your basic material exchanges once again. Um, also guys, you know, for those of you who haven't uh, been able to see it yet, uh, since the uh, the new upload, uh, we've got some kind of changes here uh, in our quests and our setups for our reputation and whatnot. Um, all reputation is now on the right hand side, uh, all bounties are on the bottom. Um, our Moments of Triumph for Year 2 is displayed on the left hand side along with a new record book from Rise of Iron which looks to be an exotic, obviously exotic, um, which we don't have a whole lot of access to it yet. Uh, you can inspect the details but once you go to unlock it sends you straight to purchase or enter code. Um, it does tell you that it's a new story campaign, new armor and weapons, new raid, new strike, new playable zone, and social space, new crucible mode and maps, and new enemies. But that's about all they're giving us right now. Uh, not seeing anything out of chain except for like uh, the way your fire team setup is. Uh, we've also now have a clan. Clan functions are currently unavailable right now, but we will have access to clan capabilities uh, on our roster, which is uh, going to be nice. We won't have to go directly to Bungie.net all the time. Um, inventory has opened up. Also, uh, materials and consumables and missions are also still there, but. Now it seems like our middle column is going to be for all of our ornaments. Um, and that's about it, guys. Just uh, going to bring you your weekly Zero video from Freak Show here and uh, kind of put you up on a few things. Um, one other thing I would like to mention, uh, I have heard a few Guardians and some of the newer ones talking about needing uh, armor materials, having a real hard time. So now, if you go back and you visit the Gunsmith, not only can you get weapon parts, you can also purchase uh, armor materials from the Gunsmith. Um, let's go take a look and see. I don't believe there's been any other changes to the gunsmiths other than they did add uh, armor materials. Okay. And I would be correct. Yes, armor materials are now uh, included in his uh, inventory. Um, let's go check out Eververse Trading. Let's see what Eververse Trading has got here. Um, I'm not sure if there's anything new. Um, nothing new so far, so, uh, we've got, uh, right now about 11 more days to Rise of Iron, guys, I hope you guys are ready for it, this is your buddy Freak Show here, and I will catch you on the flip side.